establishing the closed loop communication even with multiple Evo Max batteries is easy. First, turn each battery on and change their battery IDs in the ascending order. Since three batteries and one solar inverter were used for this video demo, the battery IDs were changed from 0 to 1, 2, and 3. Once the changes are made, the batteries need to be rebooted. Once the batteries are rebooted, they are ready to communicate with each other. To establish the battery-to-battery -battery communication, daisy chain the communication circuit using bidirectional COM parallel ports and the standard Ethernet cables. Also, activate the 120 ohm resistors on the first and the last batteries. Establish the battery bank to inverter communication using a modified Ethernet cable. And lastly, ensure that the closed loop communication is established. For detailed instructions and inverter guides, please visit fortresspower.com.